President Mohamed Bari is still insisting that his administration is combating all forms of threat to national security despite the many attacks by terrorists. This is coming after the bomb attacks on Kujay prison and the president's convoy in his home state, Katsina. The president, who spoke through the Minister of Defense, Major General Bashir Magashi, assured all law abiding citizens of their safety. He promises that his administration will leave no stone unturned in ensuring the Nigerians remain united and peaceful. It's the grand finale of the Army Day celebration. These are men of the Nigerian Army showcasing their prowess in acrobatics. President Mohamed Buhari is represented here and he has a message on the terrorism and insurgency his administration is facing. As we celebrate the achievement of the Nigerian Army, I would like to thank all the many Nigerians whose support, cooperation, and understanding has complemented the efforts of our troops. I must also register my delight with the outcome of this recently conducted operation across the country. The unity and peace of Nigeria is still paramount for this administration as disclosed. I would therefore like to use this media to share all Nigeria and your personnel to be proactive in recovering new strategies, methods and techniques of not only countering national security threats, but also exploit their skills and competence. Uh, the Chief of Army Staff, Lieutenant General Farouk Yahaya, is proud of the military irrespective of the inability to quell the firepower from insurgents, especially in the northern region. The Nigerian Army under my watch remains committed to defending the territorial integrity of Nigeria and democratic governance and values in our dear country. We have security challenges in the country. It is not peculiar to Nigeria. It is a global issue. And I think our security agencies are living to the occasion and they are managing this insecurity in Nigeria. The communication gadgets of the Nigerian army in the fight against terrorism and insurgency is one point participants bring to the fore. Royal Telecommunication Company is a satellite mobile company which is covered two thirds of the globe. We give the mobility, we give the secure communication when it comes to voice, data, maritime, special service for the government, military. The essence of this uh, uh, is for it is for mobile communication, that is communication on the roof. Uh, due to the automatic nature of the operation, the crime is involved now. For for us to be able to communicate seamlessly and we too we need to be mobile on our communication. This annual ritual no doubt will continue next year while Nigerians keep hope alive as they daily face security threats and attacks. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.